mini skirts. British fashion designer Mary Kwan, credited for designing the miniskirt, has died aged 93. Kwan pioneered the act of rebellion back in the 60s, so I think let's celebrate its history. Throwback, back, miniskirts had actually been uncovered by archaeologists, so they date back to around 4700 BC where figurines and ancient Egyptian frescoes wore them. Zoom forward to 1926 and Josephine Baker wore one made of bananas while performing in Paris. They made a handful of appearances on screen after that, but hello 1964. Mary Kwan opened the iconic boutique bazaar in 1955 in Chelsea. It became an electric scene, picture loud club-like music, free drinks. Quant raised the hemline in 64 and named them after her fave car, the Mini. She never claimed the invention as such, instead saying the real inventors are the girls, the same that you see on the street. From there, see Twiggy, Blondie, Madonna, Julia Roberts, Paris Hilton, Britney. The fashion world had changed and minis had become so politicised that when Dior failed to put them in their show, a group of women called the British Society for the Protection of Mini Skirts protest outside their show with these signs reading Mini Skirts Forever. And for real, look at British street star now. Mio Mio, Diesel, Dion Lee, Vintage Halls, the micro mini is in and I am totally here for it. Raising the hem was an act of rebellion. It symbolised breaking away from traditional gender roles, which we continue to do now. Her legacy is more relevant than ever as we continue to find ways to express ourselves.